All right, everybody, and welcome back. We're playing Clock Tower. And, uh, yeah, I'm still in this room. Uh, so far, we have uh, that one room with the mural on the wall that we really don't know what to do with, or I don't know what to do with. I'm sure one of you know what to do with it. And uh, we have a hole in the wall and some locked doors. And that's pretty much all I got to go on so far. Now, I, I seem to remember being able to get through this hole in the wall the time I played it a long time ago, but she's not really responding to it all that much, and it's definitely big enough she could crawl through it. It's crumbling. Okay. Well, I guess we'll go look around somewhere else then. We've already been in here, pretty much seen everything we can see in here as far as I know. And admittedly, I'm doing a little bit of pixel hunting off and on around here, so... I could very well be missing stuff. I don't know. I think the bird's dead. He's not moving anymore. Perf. We already checked the cage, so we know there's nothing in there. Are things any different when you turn off the lights? Does it make stuff appear? Makes the sheets purple. That's something, I guess. I'm gonna have to have a notice on this video when I stop digging around. I really need to try to figure out how to fix this room so that it doesn't look so horrible. But uh, I'm really not sure how to do that. You know, I really shouldn't be fucking around with that kind of stuff right now. The game, man. Focus on the game. Got stuff to do. Well, I suppose we can go back to that weird room. No, no, god damn it. I just want to walk across the room. I'm going to keep fast forwarding and then I'm going to run into something and I'm going to get the shit scared out of me. Hmm. Can you use the rope on the shelf? Pull it on the shelf, maybe. She has no idea what to do with it. She's looking at me like I'm stupid. It's actually like I just clicked on it. it. Doesn't even register that I had an item in my hand. There's a note here. Time will cause adherence. The clock tower's clock stopped. Okay. Yeah, I can't even click there. Okay then. Okay, well, this is going to be an eventful episode. Okay, then. So we can try everything on this. Really? Well, we made it outside. Looks like a courtyard. Look, it's my Christmas tree. That was kind of weird. It's a nice night for a swim, you know. Good cardio. saying creepy shack I think that's a door right there see if we can't make our way inside of it it's all this crap nothing we can use apparently I 
Hey there, buddy. Oh, hey. Who, who are you? Uh-huh. Food. Well, luckily for you, I shoved a ham in my dress earlier in this adventure. Um, I wanted to give him the ham. Come on. Simon Barrow. This man is Barrows? He's our fine real estate owner. He's no longer looking at Jennifer. That's car keys. Well, that was kind of useless. Don't know if I should have done that. Can't seem to let this guy out. Well, that was a waste of an item. Oh, can I pick that up? Okay. I suppose I can't. No, that was a jolly waste of a room. There's something interesting out here. And a box. That's in my way. <sighs> Poop. Well then. This was certainly disappointing. So there's nothing in here I can use. I can't even take this board, even though that's a great idea. I don't know what we would do with the board, but... I don't know. And he's still not looking at me. That's all the more reason for the cardio. How about a rock? Would you like a rock? Ah. Hmm. I can't even use the door. Like it's not even selectable. I can't try to do anything on the door. And there's something in there with him, but I can't tell what it is. So I guess we're just going to leave Mr. Barrows to be Mr. Barrows. down in there? No. <laughs> well, it certainly felt a little pointless. Huh. There has to be something to do out here. This is like the only way that I know where to go. Oh, that's nice. You didn't tell me I could click on the box. I'm guessing that goes outside. It seems the door is locked. In fact, the door doesn't even really seem to exist. Alright, and here we go. Hopefully, a door to more progress. Please tell me this is not the room we uh, started out in. That would really suck. I think it is. Why, Lord, why? Huh. Well, I feel more than slightly hopeless now. We're back in our meat room. I guess I can get another ham out of here. Nope. I have eaten the only ham available in the house. Well, I didn't eat it. I gave it to Simon. But close enough. It's gone. Now we're doomed. 
Where was that bird's nest we saw earlier in the game? Was that upstairs? Because there was something in it, I think. But we couldn't get to it because the bird flew at us. Hmm. This was locked. This room, I don't think, had anything useful in it. Oh, hello. Miss Mary? Glad to see you. Safe, Jennifer. Mary, everyone, everyone. Everything's going to be just fine. Actually, we've only seen one body here. I think we're doing pretty good, actually. There's no time for a drink. It'll... I'll drink this. It'll calm you down. But I'm underage! Huh? Ugh. Oh, underage drinking. Hey, you. Uh, where? Oh, shit, I'm here. Hey, buddy. He's no longer looking at Jennifer. Well, that's great. Hey, buddy. Jennifer! You're okay. What? Half a sec. I'll get you out. Who says that, really? There we go. Now, get out of here. Before Mary comes... Huh? Quickly! Jennifer! Hey, we should stick together. You ever seen a horror movie? Wait up, dumbass. Well, that didn't work. A voice is heard outside the shed. Now, isn't that a pity? Jennifer, don't move a muscle. I will punish you. <laughs> Boink! Oh, that was fun. Take the gun! Take the gun! Now I guess we won't take the gun. Do I have control? Yeah, I do. Let's go this way. I'm not sure that I actually accomplished anything, though. That was neat, though. Hmm. Well, things have obviously changed in the house a little bit, so I guess we can re-explore everywhere. It seems to be the adventure game sort of thing to do. Use the gold key, yay! Hmm. And poison, apparently. Is she just going to say the phone's been cut again? Yeah, she's just going to say the phone line's been cut. Hmm. There's nothing new in here. I guess we keep exploring then. So now there's two people trying to kill me. For whatever reason. Looks like a bird's nest. Let's poke it with a stick. <laughs> Can we push this over close to it? 
Nothing is inside. I don't care. I'm not trying to I'm trying to move it over here. I think I tried to throw a rock at it already. I'm a douche. Nice birdie. Looks like a oh good god, you're stupid. No, I wanted to go in there. I wanted to see if anything was different. <laughs> you know, I actually kind of like a house like this, big and quiet. You know, without the murders and everything, but, you know, just a big quiet house would be kind of cool, I think. This room just feels significant. Hmm. I don't guess anything's different in here either. Oh god damn it. I just kind of wanted a big house like this. I also kind of wanted an underground house. You know, but it's kind of hot here, so uh, I figured that would help out with cooling a lot during the summer. And yeah, this underground house, kind of labyrinthine in design. You know, a little morbid, but I think it'd be cool. Wouldn't be creepy if you built it. Oh god, this gives me a headache. Away! It would be really hard to build an underground house around here because of how moist the soil is. You have to seal it up really good or the entire place would flood. Well, everything seems good in here. How about in here? Keep turning the light switch off on light switch on and off by accident. That creeps me out every time her portrait changes color like that. I always think something important's happening. But it never is. So, uh, who wants to go back in here? I know I do. <sighs> who locked, I guess she locked the door again. Alright everybody, and welcome back. As you can see, uh, I'm not where I le we left off. Well, I've been messing around here for a little while, off camera, because I, as I said, I don't like to waste people's time, but I kind of discovered something over here. You actually have to not use this stick at all. You have to check out the bird's nest. Looks like a bird's nest. Then we can push the box over to it. So you have to do it in exactly that order. I don't think it'll work. What is this? The nest is full of eggs and junk. And there's a key in here. There's a key inside the nest. Pocketed the West Wing key, which I thought I already had, but apparently not. So, we have the West Wing key. And I found out that uh, this hallway, is o this door here is opened by the West Wing key, which... I can swear that I've already done before, but now well, let's not go over that. And that's as far as I've gotten, really. I got into this hallway. Anyway, so now we're back to natural exploring here. 
And this hallway is a really odd shade of maroon or purple, purplish stuff. Stairway. Let's not go downstairs yet. Let's see what's in here. Well, this place is creepy. Turn the volume up a little bit. Let me take your clothes. This mannequin is wearing a dress. And it lost its head. How about this one? This mannequin is also wearing a dress. Looks nice. I had a feeling that was coming, but it still made me jump. I think I'm dead. And he does his Bobby Hill dance. Ugh. Right then, let's see where this is going to put me. Okay then. Well, I could rest and just regain all my stamina, but uh, that wouldn't be very fun. So is there any actual reason to come in here, though? Hmm. So it seems like our antagonist is hiding behind there. I'd like to get my stamina back, but that's going to take a while of me just sitting around and doing nothing. So I think I might actually get this done on time, because it's only, I think, October 1st right now, as of this recording. And she's not sitting down and resting, and that really kind of sucks. There we go. So it's only October 1st at the time of this recording, so I might actually get this done on time, which would be kind of remarkable. This game is a little creepy just because there's no music. This may be the first game that I don't say that I like the music. Alright then, with that scare spoiled, I guess we can just go this way then. Walking headlong into oblivion and identical curtains. What horrors lie in this door? None, apparently, because it's broken. But this door works. Well, it feels like someone's watching. That's a hint, I'm guessing. Light switch. The switch is, of course, broken. This is a French doll. It's hung from the ceiling. That's a big clown doll. It's over here by the bed. Looks like a child's bed. It's dirty with stains and dust. Can't do anything with the record player. Hmm. Okay, she has nothing to say about that. Okay, then. That's a uproarious fire if I've ever heard one. And of course the switch is broken. The things written here look serious. Like books. I wonder who lit this. That's the first time I've ever seen a game actually make a point of someone lighting fires and torches. Usually it's just, you know, a given. Empty. Let's look out the window at all the places we wished we were. There's a pool in the courtyard. Some books. How intellectual of you. This desk is dusty. A portrait of a middle-aged woman. I'll climb out the window.
Now I keep running into rooms and I can't find anything to really do on them. I'm not playing my adventure game cards very well, I don't think. Big looming doorway. And another one of these rooms, but I can't climb up this wall, and uh, I don't see any cracks here I can dig through. Okay then. Well, I'll keep going until I get to a dead end. That looks like a trap. Okay. So if a plank of wood, we could lay it over this chasm here. First floor can be seen. Now we can push it over. I'm a handyman. What the fuck? Obvious room hidden behind there. This wall looks painted over. Look, there's a rope or noose around the statue or something. Hmm. Can I beat down the wall with a rock? No, I cannot. It actually kind of sucks. It just repeats the narrative if you click on the if you click on the uh, an object with an item. It just repeats the narrative as if you clicked on it normally, which kind of sucks. Really, I kind of like having the feedback. Oh well. Guess there's nowhere to go from here, but we can go in this door. Let's see what we got in here. Looks like a. S okay then. Away! No chance we could just take up the board, I don't guess. Ah, oh, man, I have no idea where to go to get away from this guy. What was even in here? Oh, that was a horrible place to go. Thankfully, this isn't Phantasmagoria. I would have instantly just got myself killed there. Damn it, woman. Be more careful. Creepy kids room. I don't think there's any reason to go in there. And I'm running into them. <laughs> ah. Happy Bobby dance. Well, that didn't go too well. I did it. Before he was that way, so I'm gonna run this way. What? I wanted to do that last time. Okay then, I guess that works. Is this where I ended up going? No, it was at the very end of this hallway. Nope, never mind, I guess it was in here. I don't know what I'm talking about. I never know what I'm talking about. It looks kind of like there's a door or something back here. It might be hard for you guys to see on YouTube, but... Well, what do you know? There's a crack in the wall. But... No, no, no. I want you to do other stuff first. There's some tableware here. Okay. I guess I can beat down the wall with a 2 by 4 She breaks a lot of stuff, you know. Hmm. 
There's a room over there. Thank you, Jessica. This looks like my bedroom. It hasn't been used in ages. How do you know? The air in this room is stagnant. Okay. I don't see anything in here. Can't turn the light switch. Can't look at these markings. Does room have a point? I mean, it looks creepy. I'm not really sure why I'm here, though. Hmm. This must be the door that we couldn't get into before. Though there's no reason why you can't get into it, it just doesn't even let you click on it. Well, that's kind of annoying. Hmm. So, so far I haven't found a single room that had any use to it yet. This game's really frustrating at times. I expect every room to have a purpose, and I haven't found any that were that useful yet. Maybe I'm just missing the obvious. Or maybe this is the room that, uh... Eh, it doesn't matter. Well, we dropped, uh, our villain down here, so... Alright, I guess we can go this way. More rooms to explore. More rubble. Nothing to see here. Let's move along. Well, this room just looks pleasant. <gasps> a corpse of a crow. There's a key here. Pocketed the cage key. And what's in the cage, exactly? Rats scurrying around. A single bird is left in the cage. I'm gonna regret this. The rats ran away. Go! Be free! I hope I find a way out of here too. Oh, that was nice. Got to save some animals. Seems the door is locked. Get in there. Well, this room doesn't look creepy at all. There's only junk inside. And he's behind the curtain. And I was right, he was behind the curtain. I really don't know how to shake him this time. I didn't know how to shake him last time either, though. That was just kind of an accident. Uh, poop. God damn it. None of these rooms really seem great to run into. I didn't even know what was in here. Crap. Go this way then. What's in here? Ah, shit, no more I can hide. What about in here?
That sounds like a horrible idea to try to hide in there. Is he even around anymore? Or am I just running from nothing? Damn it, I keep running into these rooms. I'd be so horrible at this in real life. God damn it. We already kind of established there's nowhere good to go in there. And this is just like last time, he's gonna be right over here. Oop, I don't know where to go. Quiet all of a sudden. I guess we should. I guess we lost him or something. Works for me. I won't question a good thing. We're going the right way. Nope. Where am I? I actually don't know where I'm going right now. I'm trying to get back to the stairs. There we go. So what was I doing? I already freed the, the crows and stuff in there, so I think I was in this room. The room that had a piano in it. No, this is the library. Books are lined up here, as they generally are inside of a library. This crevasse looks pretty deep. There's something shining in there that bites my hand off. Okay, so you can't just reach your hand in there. Guess we'll have to find some way to reach in there. Looks like a very old magazine. A maternity magazine. Okay. There's a slip of paper in a book. Hold the demon idol with something. Sorry. A slip of paper in the book. Hold the demon idol with great care. A tree in the forest, a person in the crowd, an idol is on a statue. I guess I read too slow for this game. What do I have over here? The author's name is Faded. Okay. How about over here? Lots of technical books. Right. Well, the idle thing is probably a clue for something. Maybe that room uh, back in the second foyer that has the uh, mural on it. Might be something to do with that room. I don't know. That room just fascinates me for some reason. There's no toilet. And what murder will be behind this curtain? Ah. ah, just a kitty cat. A very demonic looking kitty cat. But a kitty cat nonetheless. Jennifer is still shocked by the experience. I need to wash my hands. I like this room. I, I really do. It's peaceful here. I kind of just want to stay here forever. But that would be boring. I don't guess we can go any further that way. So we're going back to the piano room. That's kind of the last clue I have for now. Already kind of out of ideas, which sucks. Ugh. I'm a little rusty on the whole adventure game thing, I'm afraid. 
Okay. This is the crow room. So what was this? The door is locked. And this one. This is the piano room. So there might be a few more rooms left to explore. What do we have over here? A record player. It's unplugged. There's all kinds of music here. That was lame. Okay then. I guess Jennifer's not much of a music person. And the last room we get. Nope. Another hallway. This leads outside. And now we're back here. Okay, so I guess we just found another way we can cut through the house. We're not done here just yet. Well, this room certainly looks unpleasant, too. And sounds unpleasant. And you're breaking shit. Ah, this game. It's 4.30 in the morning right now. All is quiet within the house. And he's in here. Nope. Apparently nothing's in there. Okay. Well, poop. Stop doing that. Have I exhausted all my options already? Anyway, guys, on that note, I think I'm going to call it a video. I've been at this for quite a while now, off and on. As always, thank you guys very much for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, I'll have some better ideas by then. Uh, I really don't know. Um, like I said, my adventure gaming's a little bit rusty, apparently. I'm having a little bit of difficulty with this one. But who knows? If it doesn't turn out, I won't upload it. And if it does, I will. Then you... No, it worked out because you're seeing it. I'll see you guys next time.